you know, it's important, is it, when you come off the bench, you know, you make an impact. I mean, you know, what did what did the boss say to you when, when you came on? He just said, "Come on and be explosive." Um, I think he changed it to a four-three-three when I came on. So he told me to be on the right. So I thought I was going to get in trouble when I was over on the left. So luckily, um, yeah, it all worked out. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I think the, you know, I think Paul Lewis drove forward and he's just on as a sub as well. Yeah. Kieran was involved, and then you you get the ball out of the penalty area. Did you just decide to jig onto your right and then have a go? Yeah, so I think I, Corey let it run to me, and when I cut in, I just see I see everything open up. I was like, I've got to shoot here, um, and I think I couldn't have caught it any sweeter. So yeah. Are you going to have a, a contest with Corey about whether his goal on Tuesday was the better winner of the game or yours was tonight? <laughs> no, I'm just happy to win. You seem as if you're sharp again now. I mean, obviously, you know, you, you came here, had a few injury problems, didn't you? you've worked your way through. But you seem much sharper now as a player. Yeah, like, so obviously I missed pre-season. Uh, it took a while to get up to speed. Then I had a few niggly injuries, but they're all gone now. So I've just got to fight for my place in the team. But uh, as long as everyone's doing well and we're winning, can't complain. When you look at the bench, I mean, you know, there's, there's quality on the bench as well as on the pitch, as you say. You know, it's important. You know, you make your mark when you do come on. Yeah, I think the the bench could start in any other team in this league. Um, so it just shows you how strong the, the actual squad is. So everyone's got to be like on top of their game. You were at Swindon last year, I think, uh, when they got promotion. I mean, yeah. do you see the same qualities in this Tranmere squad? Yeah, that's the reason I came here. Um, obviously, I see the recruitment that the manager done in the summer. And this, to me, it looked like the, sh the squad was a lot stronger than it was last season. And I think we finally clicked now. And I think there's seven unbeaten. And I think that the fans can start to see that there's a good team here. Difficult to talk about the match of the cup, I suppose, when the fans aren't inside the ground. But having said that, you know, a really big cup draw on Monday night now, you know, you, you could have another big team here. We've had Spurs and Man United here over the last few seasons. Yeah, of course. And I think um, we, we're allowed 2,000 2, fans allowed. So hopefully they can come and cheer us on if we do get a good um, home round. You're looking forward to that because you know, it's been strange for you, hasn't it, being here without any yeah. crowds inside the ground? Yeah, very strange. I don't think uh, anyone realises how much a crowd makes a difference of a game. Uh, there's certain times when you're losing, you just need the crowd just to push you on, or even when you're winning, to push you on and get more goals. So yeah, we were talking about that Tuesday night as well, and that's you know two one 0 victories in a row, and you know it's those tight games, isn't it? Where you know you just need that little bit of extra behind you, and the crowd can be of a big help to you. Of course, that like 80 minutes if it's still nil nil, that crowd can just push you on, spear you on, might might make you press someone a bit quicker, a bit harder, and you just get another goal, so yeah. You mentioned the run that the team's on at the moment. Uh, have you noticed something different, if you like? I mean, and obviously the confidence levels rise, but you know, what's, what's changed things around? I just feel like the boys are working harder for each other. Um, that's all I think it is, and obviously when you're working harder, the things started going our way. Um, and yeah, everyone just seems a bit, lot more confident, and I think you can tell on the pitch. I suppose a lot of the credit will go to Brackley tonight, won't it? I mean, you know, they're the the other side, 56 places below. You think you look at the pyramid, but you know, cup ties are different, and you have to have to work for everything on the pitch. Of course, like I said in the, at the start, I thought it was very good. They made us fight for that. We only um, won one nil, but obviously them coming here, you probably think we'd we'd batter them, but it wasn't it wasn't the case today. And as you say, as a substitute, you know, your job is to put pressure on the guys who are the, in the starting eleven, isn't it? And, and sort of, course, of you know, yeah. make sure the manager's in your eye. That's the only thing I can do. I can only come on and help the team as much as I as much as I can. Luckily, I got a goal today. But um, yes, everyone's got to just keep fighting for their spots and keep going.